A government minister wants more young people involved in politics, but a youth representative says there are too many barriers in the way. The topic came up for a discussion on Monday night when the Association of Bahamian Students and the Grenada Students Association of Cave Hill hosted a panel discussion. Youth Minister Stephen Lashley said more young people needed to play a role for regional political processes to change. However, former Youth Prime Minister Roshanna Trim said older people were reluctant to give young people a chance. We have an issue with turning over the wheels of power. So what we do is that we hold on for as long as we can, and then perhaps we die, or we don't have a choice but to leave, and then power is expressed on somebody else. So we have an issue with continuity plan. So as young people, we rarely find ourselves in position of power because first we refuse to give us the opportunity to step into the position. And it, it, it often isn't that there are these obstacles or policy or legislation that says that we can't step into leadership positions is those invisible barriers such as party, loyalty, or oh, you young, you inexperienced, you doing your name. And politics is expensive, like I tell you, politics is expensive. So as a young person, particularly as a woman, I'm the only woman in my family, as a woman, we are you are disadvantaged when it comes to stepping into the realms of politics, and Travis will correct me if I'm wrong, but politics are expensive. And I'm not going to talk long because I really want to engage. But politics is also, to a certain level, and youth involvement can be tokenistic. We have issues with tokenism. Where they give young people play positions and they let us sit on different boards and do different things, and we feel in the beginning, we're like, yay. And then you get there, you realize. Y'all can hear me? <laughs> is, is this thing on? Because you feel as if you are not being heard. 